Um, as it looks like both teams are going to be playing four up top, Shawnee. Absolutely, and for the first time in this game, I believe, Toby, because normally we see a rotation towards the grenades, be it by either Baghdad or, I believe, uh, Devour. But either way, uh, for the first time, uh, both teams really sticking up top, and we wait to see. But uh, a bit of shots going in here. Is Creamy going to try and look for that snuff pistol headshot? But right now, no kills to start off with, and it's kind of to be expected, I guess, Toby. These teams have been disconnected for a little bit, so I imagine they're just trying to get back into it. Yep. But is this the break of momentum that Rift needs to stop this, this absolute train that this XS squad is? It might seem like it from the first down. Angel's going to get down first of all, but he will get revived. And it was actually back. Pillory got down as well, which Creamy tried to make use of with his teams. But he is going to get down now as the scales have surely turned. Yeah, Creamy's still down at the moment, but D2 needs to be a little bit careful himself. Creamy will be getting up very shortly uh, in, the, in the moment, but they're going to obviously look to try and barrage him and try and take him down. He somehow... Gets away for a split second, but D2 down as well. Revive going in, Toby. This is getting a little bit panicky now if you're Rift, I feel. Because Creamy might instantly die here because he had a free down roll. You know, Shawnee, I think they needed the down on that Anya there. That red line is so focused on trying to down. I don't think they're going to get it now. Creamy on that last down. He is up, but he will get taken out. You can see bottom left of your screen, folks. That is a man advantage to XS in potentially this last round. All they need to do now is kill these last three members of Rift Gaming and they get a spot guaranteed in the Grand Finals. Yeah, massive stuff for them, and then, and then Rift have to go back down to take on Infused in the loser's bracket final, of course. And there's a big kill from the Snub Pistol from Redline that makes it 3v3. What a turnaround there, Toby, and what a huge kill as SBR goes down. Oh, Redline down as well, I think that is it. Devour's coming. No, Devour. they're reviving each other. Devour's coming. They are up, Devour is still is pushing. Baghdad is down, though. They need to revive quickly, XS, before this Rift squad move in. Baghdad is up. They are pushing. It's going to be a battle for the sniper. It seems Redline is going to go down. SPR gets it down back. It is still a 2v2 situation. SPR needs to find a 1v from somewhere quickly, though. And he's found Baghdad. But will he get crossed, though? It seems like it. There we go, folks. XS are going to land a spot for themselves in the Grand Finals. Yeah, unfortunately, anticlimactic in the circumstances. But all the same, what a glorious round it was. Both teams pushed very, very hard. And XS, even though they win the Series 3-0... Every game in that was really competitive, and it was great to see. But it was, it was just there, and uh, there is a reason why, of course, uh, XS are the team who just seem to fight back and be so resilient all the time, and they just make the magic happen. Do you think we found a favorite team for the for the grand finals, Shawnee? I think XS are in a good spot, aren't they? I mean, they're the only team who have yet to go down to the losers bracket in this uh, tournament, so. I mean, it's got to be with them at the moment, surely. But who knows? Let's see how Infuse perform against Rift. Or who knows? Let's see how Rift perform against Infuse. We just don't know yet. Oh, we're not going to a break. Ignore that, folks. <laughs> I keep doing that. But it will be. As I, as, I, as I actually said earlier as well, well, just now, favorite team. In my eyes, they seem like the favorite team, Shawnee. 3-0 win over Rift Gaming. That's incredible. It wasn't... That so far apart for Gfinity in the European Open, but it seems to be tonight. The uh, of course, folks, the next match will be Team Infused versus Rift Gaming. You can see the bracket on your screen now. Rift will drop down to the losers bracket finals, and XS Esports have gained themselves a position in the grand finals. We'll go into the prizes once again in a little while, folks. But first, we're going to get go to a quick great quick break excuse me as we quickly try to get these players and teams in Hey girl from community, my name is Shadows, welcome to this Gears of War Ultimate Edition Top 5 Plays of the Week. Starting off with clip number 5, we're going to be on board with a guy known as Momentum Fruz, who's got the teammate supporting him on his back. As he downs a few in Sniper Tower, he gets the triple with Boom across map, possibly a Hail Mary. I don't know, that's how you work the game though with your teammates. Moving on to clip number 4, on board with IB Matrix on Clock Tower, misses a few shots on the first guy but comes off the wall, bodies him, downs the next guy, is in a fight with Minyong Kim in the third battle. There you go, literally dying as they come at him. 
Moving on to clip number three, we have Mythic Godhead, possibly a game attack change after you see this clip to Mythic Gearhead. He literally downs the first guy, turns around, bodies the next guy with a headshot, downs the next guy. They're literally just dropping at his knees on Clock Tower. Seems like that's a popular map for the clips. Moving on to clip number two, second place in this top five plays. We have the Nox Dez, maybe I pronounced that wrong, but he actually Nubi rolls the first guy, makes up it with an up A for the second guy, turns round, gets four pointed. Do not worry though, he bodies the next two guys like it's literally nothing. So there you have it. Moving on to clip number one, the winner, M Crazed, of this Gal Top 5 play for Gears of War Ultimate Edition. Pop shots the first guy with the sniper, gets an insane back A shot of the sniper. Insane! Make sure he gets the triple with the no scope to finish it up there. So there you go, guys. That is this Gears of War Ultimate Edition Top 5 plays of the week. My name is Shadows. I'm a Gears of War YouTube content creator who creates content such as live gameplays, tips and tricks, and tutorial videos, and videos focused. Focusing on the information and the latest news to the Gears of War franchise, including Gears of War 4. Be sure to check out my YouTube channel, link down below. Hope you guys have enjoyed this Gears of War forum, top 5 plays for Gears of War Ultimate Edition. Thanks for watching and hopefully we shall see you on the next one. Enjoy the rest of the content here on the channel. Sometimes we forget why we're here. It's easy to fall off track. Help us remember. These battle scars don't look that good. Sometimes we forget why we're here. It's easy to fall off track. These help us remember. These battle scars don't look that good. What it means when your faith is falling beneath your knees and you can't breathe. Everything you see reminds you of what you're not, of something you won't be. You gotta take what you're given, that's how we live it. Don't be mad at the system, it's simply how we've existed. I hear a lot of people talking like the politicians are choose to be in account because it's safe in the business. Not because they wanna do it, just because they heard it pays. And who the fuck wants to be poor? No one, that's how we get raised. Society is getting heavy. I can feel the weight, the pressure of success. It's like a hundred million pounds of shame. And that's the reason I'm staying up late, trying to find a way to escape the stereotypes. The day and age is making me feel like the only way I'll be happy is getting signed to a label and making money through rapping. I wanna share my emotion because this world is attacking the very principle of life that lets the people be happy. If you don't have a reason to breathe, why even live? These battles cause our impressions of everything that it is.
think I'm not so tired I just feel the pressure of the thing that I have in mind I want it peace, I want it to be fine I wonder why I cannot just sit for a while I really want to see what it looks like To have a moment I know that would be mine When the wind is all close Like a picture of the time When the future is the